it was reported earlier in training camp that the Miami Dolphins were interested in pursuing some additional depth at the offensive tackle position. Brian Flores, when asked of the report, indicated that the Dolphins are evaluating ways to better every aspect of the roster as is every team in the NFL. He didn't dish much in the way of specifics, but actions do speak louder than words. Which is relevant, given that the Dolphins acquired O.T. Greg Little via trade from the Carolina Panthers this week. Little, a top 40 pick in the 2019 NFL Draft, certainly meets the physical skill set the Dolphins have traditionally gravitated towards during this Chris Greer, Flores regime. Which means it shouldn't be a surprise to hear that Miami apparently liked quite a bit about Little during the pre-draft process back in 2019 when Little was coming out of Ole Miss. That intel apparently played a strong hand in Little landing with the Dolphins for a 2022 seventh-round pick. We have some familiarity with him from the draft a couple years ago. It was an opportunity to get a young player, come in and compete. Look, it's a new environment and new locker room. He's got to learn the playbook. He's got to learn his teammates. He's got to figure out the surroundings here in our building and this area, said Flores on Thursday. We had a 30 visit with him so we sat down and talked to him. There was some good rapport there. As far as his love for the game and passion about working and getting better. Obviously on film, he's athletic and has size. He was competitive on film. We are happy to have him but look, this is a process. We will just take it one day at a time and try to improve and get better. Miami gave Lil some basic run with the second team offense at left tackle upon his arrival to Miami earlier in the week, but the team does feel intent on slow playing his onboarding process and not overwhelming a young player going through his first team change of his NFL career after two underwhelming seasons in Carolina. And, with the pre-trade reports indicating that Miami was hopeful for tackle depth, it seems reasonable to think that Little will have a chance to get his wits about him without the stresses of being thrust into the starting lineup barring injury. That's at least the plan in place according to Flores. The message to him is let's take it one day at a time, let's try to improve, get better, learn the system, get to know your coaches, get to know the players on the team, figure out where the bathrooms are, figure out where the meeting rooms are, figure out where 595 is. That's kind of where we're at right now. We'll take it one day at a time and just try to improve and get better. We will coach him up and see where it goes. We're happy to add him. My conversation with him was very good. He's excited to be here and excited for the opportunity to compete.